Hello, hello, this is Mystic Moho, and I come to you today with the Divine Feminine Read. So Divine Feminine has a, a message, a public service announcement. Message! She got a message. Hmm. Says Divine Feminine. Real women hustle hard, my dear, to get theirs, honey. Unlike you, comic, my friend, comic, my dear, comic, darling, dear, I don't have, I don't have the characteristic of being a matrix matty and laying on my back and just having the give me itis. I know real women hustle hard to get what they want. They strive for what they want, and when they get it, they cherish it because what? They worked hard to get it. They ain't lay on their back to get that money because grandma said anything that comes in your possession, honey, and you don't work hard for it, baby, it ain't going to stay in your possession long because you ain't going to cherish it because it's not going to have any value, okay? So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today, Spirit Gods, Ancestors, we come to you today because we want to know why Divine Feminine is telling these people, real women hustle hard, not lay on their backs and be mattress mayishas, okay, so what is the energy of Divine Feminine? Divine Feminine, yes, if we want to know what is the energy of Divine Feminine's haters. Okay, so the first uh, arcana that comes out on the spinter is the Page of Pentacles. So they're not only broke, but they're immature. Yes, when one is in a Page of Pentacles energy, they have mature, they have non-maturity behind them. They act immature. They have childlike behaviors. They lack energy. They are a time waster and they don't have any time time management skills. What else does that divine feminine needs to know about these people that's in the interest, the in energy of Mattress Maddie and they ain't hustling hard? Yes, divine feminine, they are in a moon energy. And when one is in a moon energy, they are in secrets, they are in deceit, they are in the they are in lies. This person may have instability in the past, they may have done magic. And this person is also very materialistic. So what else is the energies going on with this person that stays on their back and doesn't hustle hard? Okay. So this person is in a tower energy. They are in the energy where we fall down. But they ain't getting back up. Don't look like they getting back up. Because this tower came in reverse. They are in imprisonment for what they did to others. Others are avoiding them. They are in a disaster energy. They are in an energy that they fear the choices that they made was not good ones. Okay? So that is the energy of the comic. But we want to know why Divine Feminine is telling these people over here that's doing these things that's incorrect. Why is she telling them? Why is she saying real women hustle hard for this? They ain't got a case of give me itis laying on their backs, you know. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me got shot. Along with his son name, please. So please stop your begging, honey. Please go somewhere with your gimmies. Gimme got shot. Yeah, he got shot. Along with his son name, please. So please. Get out of the gimmies and go get your own, says Divine Feminine. What else is you saying, Divine Feminine? We would like to know, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we would like to know the energies of Divine Feminine. And why is she telling these people, I'm hustling hard, girl. I, ooh, which one won the fall first? So, the one, hey, yes. Divine Feminine is in the energy where
what she said. Anybody that crossed her and did her wrong, she don't care about your sorrows. She don't care about how you feel. Please keep your sorrows. Please keep your dick, your six feet. Please keep your distance with your sorrows. Says the divine feminine. The first card that comes out is sorry, not sorry. She saying for all of those that sat there and lied to me and gave me those those hater like liar energies. Keep that over there and give me six feet, darling, there, because we don't do that over here. We leave that hate up at the door. We don't drink hatering. We don't drink that over here. Yes. And she's saying, you a uh, success hater. You know you hating on my success, darling. You hating on the fact that I'm winning. You hating on the fact that you wanted uh, uh, ill will to come to me, and you still see me winning. Darling, dear, instead of worrying about me winning, and all the glow ups and grow ups that I'm doing with my life, baby. But excuse me, excuse me, spiritual bells, divine feminine says, baby, what you need to do is stop having yourself up in the uh, emergency room. Please stop having yourself up in the ERs and things because uh, you was over there dealing with uh, sexually transmitted diseases, girl. I'm going to need you to stop it over there now. Mm-hmm, says Divine Feminine. Sex isn't wrong, but you got to be right. And if you had sex, you better wrap it up tight. Listen to me, because Mohawk ain't joking. Don't wrap it up, and then your ass will be smoking. This is something that you don't do, girl, because this card comes out a lot for you. And the next card that comes out is... Girl, you lives a facade, honey. You lives your life. You lives your three, your dreams through your lower extremities. This is all you know how to do. Mm. And then when somebody point out to you, Mattress Maddie, Mattress Maddie, when someone points it out to you that you the whole, yes, and you have thought-like tendencies, baby, you act like the damn victim. Oh, I don't do those things. Oh, I don't. That that what happened with me. Oh, I don't. I wasn't with them. Oh, I don't. I don't know them, girl. Don't play the victim. You know you was over there giving it up, popping that thing, guys. You was over there being a zipper fly, but zip it, zip it, zip it. Yeah, that was you, darling. So please, when you do your um, your whole like. Thought, thoughtful like tendencies, darling. Do it and be proud that you a hoe. Do it and be proud that you a thought. Don't do it and then after you do it and your questions about your thought like behaviors, you want to sit there and play victim. Don't do that, darling. Live up to your hoe like tendencies. Mm-hmm. This is why you lonely. And don't nobody want to be with you like that. You're only wanted for your lower extremities because you are a bugaboo bitch. This is what you do. You do spells. You do magic. You do evil, hateful things. You do tantric sex to get a man. And then after you get him, darling, you treat him like shit and go on with the next one and live your karmic life. Darling, says Divine Feminine, you need to heal, baby. Baby. You need to go through that dark night of the soul and get yourself the dark night of the soul. Let me say that right. And get yourself together, baby, says Divine Feminine. Because you know and I know that your damn birth certificate is your birth certificate is an apology from the condom factory, darling. You were a mistake. Girl, they were supposed to swallow you that night. This is why you're always in an energy that you're calling the police and there's domestic violence going on in your home because now you're going through an issue where divine masculine is ignoring you. He don't want to be bothered with you. Everyone has caught on to the behaviors that you do. Everyone has caught on to the magic that you do, darling. And these behaviors that you're expressing over there that uh, real women don't do because they care about your, their kids cognitively, they're not going to put their self in the energy where they're fighting and fussing and putting their selves and their children in domestic situations. But because you a comic and you like to argue and you like to fight and you feel like divine feminine has won, this is all you want to do is fight. 
because you feel like divine feminine and she did defeated you because she sent that magic back and now she on her way to healing she's on her way to grounding she's on her way to loving her spirituality and loving herself and this is why you feel defeated comic yeah Everyone knows this is why don't no one wants to be around you, comic says Divine Feminine. You are a toxic lover. You are known for being jealous. You are known for taking advantage of, of others. You are known for walking over others. You are known for not having no self-control and you are possessive and jealous. This is why you can't keep a man, says Divine Feminine. This is why your man stay all up in my energy because he knows that you are a comic and you're not on my level. But darling, I don't know how many times I have to tell you this. Please stay out my energy, darling. I'm in an energy where I am saying time heals all wounds. I forgive you for being a dumb bitch that doesn't know magic. I forgive you for being a spiritual hater bitch that tried to pray on my downfall. I forgive you for thinking that you was going to break up a relationship and he still don't want you. I forgive you for all those hateful things that you did. And I pray for you, darling. Yes, I do. Because something is wrong with you and you need to seek help. Because anyone, says Divine Feminine, that gives me that much attention and, and, and is collecting rent in their brain because they're constantly thinking about me continue my dear i give you that with all open arms and every time that you send that hate to me i'm going to send that back to you with open arms and every time that you try to do magic on me i'm going to send that back to you with open arms but i'm still going to pray for you because i was taught you don't hate on your enemies you pray for them. So I'm going to pray for you, darling, because I don't want that same karma that you got by being hateful and using jealousy, envy, and strife against another for their downfall. You're only wishing it on yourself, baby girl. Yeah. And Divine Feminine says, yeah, I know that you all are always over there in the comic community. You're always fighting. Because what you thought was, you thought you was going to get a Divine Masculine that was going to take care of you. But this Divine Masculine woke up to you, darling. And now you're trying to figure out how you're going to get that bag. I know that you're jealous of me, baby girl, because I'm a boss bitch. This is why you're always sending those hate messages to me. I know, baby girl. I know. I know. But again, I pray for you because you have a wretch soul, baby girl. I don't hate you. I, lo I love the fact that you envy me. I love the fact that you hate on me, darling, because my biggest success, my biggest success, is to see you see me winning i don't have to say anything i just shine and i know my my light just dim you off you little comic demon you i know you get mad that i'm winning and i'm gonna say don't drink that hate coke would be better it's easy to make if that won't do Smoke a J or two, but comic stop that hate. Oh, oh that hate. And Divine Feminine is saying, yes, girl, you did all that magic, all the tantric sex, all the lies, the deceit, and all those things that you did to get the man, and he still don't want you. You're in the energy of being in Splitsville. Not only is he cheating on you, but you're constantly fussing. You're constantly fighting. You're always in the mattress back, divine masculine blues. Yes, because he still wants who? Me, baby. Yes, this first card that comes out is Splitsville. The comic is in the energy where she 
is upset because she knows that divine masculine does not want her. All the magic and the spells and all the lies and the deceit, it worked for a minute, but it isn't working. He still have his mind on this one, and this is divine feminine card, yes. And she's still in her. She still want to be in your energy, baby. This next card that comes out is want to be me copycat, bitch. Yes. She still stays in your energy, baby. Yes. She still stays in your energy, darling, dear. And now she's upset. Yes, baby girl. Because the masculine is now showing her fake love straight up to her face. Yes. She's getting the fake love. The fake love all up and through the face. Yes. And they're butting heads and fighting and things. And this karmic knows he wants you, baby girl. The next card that comes out is wants the ex back. Okay? So the karmic knows that he still wants to be in your energy. So her and Divine Masculine is taking digs to each other. They're constantly fussing. They're constantly fighting. They're using sharp tongues to each other. And they're in the energy that the comic know wanna wanna get back with me is Obi. Test the patience of me is Obi. Bring it karma to me is Obi. It's O. Better drop down to your knees is Obi. It's O. It's O V comic. It's over. You mad, baby girl. The only reason why he over there with you, darling, dear, because I don't want nothing to do with him. I made it loud and perfectly clear. I don't want nothing to do with you. It is over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Over. Let me say it again. Want to get back with me? It's over. Test the patience of me. It's O.V. Want to bring karma to me? It's O.V. Over. It's O.V. It's over. And the next card that comes out is done. Dun dun. Stick or fuck in me, says Divine Feminine. Didn't I tell both of y'all it was done? But no, baby girl. You had him for so long and now he done with you. Don't want nothing to do with you. Found out that you was a mattress baby and you wasn't doing nothing. So to get the masculine, you was fake faxing. Oh, I got a job. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got a master's degree. Mm -hmm. I got my own house. Mm -hmm. Girl, that is not your house. You did not, you cannot produce no deed for what you have, baby girl. You are on Section 8, daughter. You cannot call the di the city of the District of Columbia and say, Can I get a survey of my backyard? Oh, God, that is pissing me off. I keep getting these surveys for these trees. D.C., I love y'all, and I understand that this is a, what do they say? A green city. I have this tree in my backyard. This joker is hovering over my neighbor's roof. Guess what? If it does something to his roof and does some type of damage, I'm responsible. So I can't cut the tree, can't prune the tree, can't do nothing to the tree until the city of the District of Columbia comes out here and do some type of survey on the tree. That just pissed me off. I'm sorry. I just got all tanks with this damn house thing. Yes. But anyway, call me. You want to go over there and you want to say, oh, yeah, I ain't got a house, girl. You do not got no house, girl. If you did not go to closing, if you did not go to closing, if you did not go to closing, and you don't have a deed in your name, girl, that is not your house. If you cannot claim a window, a door, and repairs you did to your house on your taxes at the end of the year, that is not your house. So, girl, anyway, girl, keep on trying it, girl. Yeah, that's how she got the vibe masculine. She was fake or flexing. She made it seem like she had the money and all those things, and they found out they was broke. Her and her comic. Hey, this come out two times. Listen. Listen, Linda, Linda, listen, 
Linda. Listen. Linda, this first card that come out is common friends. Can't fully trust them. Tension, secret competition. They helps the comet do magic. And this come out again. Tag teaming hate. Seeking assistance from others. The tag team hate. Yeah, this is what she did. This is why Divine Feminine said real women hustle hard. Real women hustle hard. We ain't know where there being no mattress back like you. A real woman ain't got time to be sitting on her damn back. A real woman get her ass up at the crock of dawn and take her monkey ass to work. A real woman got her own big nag doing her own thing. She ain't waiting on no man to do nothing for her. Because one thing for certain and two things to show, if a man give you something, he could take that shit back. I was taught at a real early age. Trayshawn, Juanita Joe, ain't nothing like your own. Have your own car. Yes, when I was 16, my father bought me my own car. Not only did he bought me a car, he bought me a stick. And he said, you gonna learn how to drive this five-speed, my daughter. Because ain't no man gonna leave you nowhere. Hmm. And I ain't drove an automatic since. You can't pay me. To put my hand on the automatic, not me. I got to control that thing myself. I will never drive an automatic because I'm not an automatic kind of chick. I don't want nobody to determine how fast and slow I go. I want to move my hand and my foot and determine it myself. But anyway, Divine Feminine is saying, yeah, real women hustle hard for theirs. They don't try to do black magic on another to get ahead of another. Real women hustle hard. They ain't pers pers promiscuous out there selling their body. Divine Feminine know her body is her temple and ain't everybody worth her temple. Everybody that smiles in your face ain't worth you. That's what I was told. I was told if 99 men smile in your face and you give your body to 99 men, when it comes to that hundredth one that's supposed to be your husband, you ain't got nothing to offer him. Because you done gave it to those other 99. Hmm. My body is my temple. And only those that's worth me can have me. I'm not having sex with everybody. No, I being no mattress back. Don't you know when you have sex with people, darling dear, their soul and all the souls of the souls of the souls that they done had sex with. You now having sex with all those nasty souls and all those nasty souls just intertwining with each other. That's why I don't get down. I understand that people have to sell their body and that's the oldest profession of the world. But y'all don't understand when y'all have sex with a whole lot of people, you're picking up their soul. You're picking up their entity. You're picking up their entity, their energy, and it's going right in your body, whether it be good or bad. But it's okay. Divine masculine is in the energy where he regret doing you wrong. He in the energy where would he regret picking that comic. He in the energy that he, all those things that he said, he's now realizing. I was the demise of this relationship for my actions. And now he's mad at you, baby girl, because you happy. This next card that comes out is happiness hater. He's, he's mad. He's hating you got over him. He's hating that you won't take him back. He thought all this time you will give in and go back to that. You have not looked back. You got tunnel vision, my Ben. You, my friend. I don't see to the right of me. I don't see to the left of me. I am sitting there and I'm sure I ain't looking back. I am stepping, looking forward. I have tunnel vision, my friend. No righty, no lefty. None of that. And she's saying, baby, you a happiness hater because you got that bad karma on your back. You got that bad karma on your back because you picked a crazy bitch out, out, out there. Hey, JD, that crazy bitch out there again. Yes, you picked a psycho bitch. Now you got anxieties because of what you picked, the decision that you made. You picked a drunk bitch. You picked a bitch that stopped taking her birth control so she can have an old keeper nigga, baby. Hmm, but you in denial. 
Mm-hmm. That you picked a sneaky bitch over divine feminine. Now you waking up from that dream. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Now he's over there investigating you, seeing what's going on in your life, seeing who you dating, seeing who you been with. Yes, that is the energy that he is in. What other energies that divine masculine is in? We would like to know. He stay drinking. He stay drinking. Yes, this next card that comes out is intoxicated. And this one comes out, he's broken in the back of goddamn glass in the trash. And he's upset because baby girl that will be divine feminine is a narcissist. A no, he is upset that divine feminine is unbothered and knows that he's a narcissist and knows that he's a fraud. Yes, he's all up in his feelings, baby girl, because you found out about him. Yeah, he's all up in your feelings that you found out about his lies. Now he's having an obsession. With you, baby girl. Now he's living in the shadows and lurking and hawking and stalking. Wondering what you're doing with yourself. And who you're doing it with. What else is Divine Feminine doing? And Divine Fem the Feminine saying, please stop being a hater. Please stop being a hater. Baby, because darling dear, you keep trying to bring everything on that magic. You keep trying to bring everything on that magic. But baby boy. You let the comic have control over you. That is a deal that you had with yourself. You have to take that up with yourself, darling, because you put yourself in that energy with the comic. Excuse me. Now people want to get off the task. Alaric, we don't. We 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 not even gonna deal with you today. We not gonna deal with you today, Alaric. That man comes up on everybody's daggone thing. We're not going to mess with you today, Alaric. Oh, God. Now I done lost the day. Don't think this thing is on my mind. Okay, well, it done started all over. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. We stopped it here with the line. Man, please stop the hate child. Yes. You let the comic, you keep putting that. The comic had control over you with the magic. Please stop. Go stand in the corner. You are now in time out because I'm tired of your lies, says Divine Feminine. She said, didn't I tell your ass you I had enough? Didn't I tell you? Go stand in the corner. I had enough. You are in time out. I don't know about you, but I ain't getting no time outs. I ain't get time outs. When my mother said, ATW, yeah. ATW was an automatic ass whooping. Yes. Automatic ass whooping. When my mother said ATW. No. You got to look. What is this? That was that. No, it wasn't even no what is this. It was just. Okay. Keep it up. That's what my mother was saying. Keep it up. Because I'm going to light your ass up. It's going to be Christmas up in here. Because I'm going to light your ass up. Next thing my mother said. A-T-O. That was it. Honey, that we was good. I don't know about you. But I cut up. Cut up. Cut up. Cut up. Cut up. All day. Think my mother forgot about that. Cut up. Cut up. Cut up. Cut up. All day. Honey, when it was time to get in the tub, baby, get out the tub wet and get whooped with a switch. Child, whew, you be feeling like that so that, that switch done pulled the soul out your body. Because all you hear is, didn't I tell you? Yes, that was what I got when I was a kid. I don't know about y'all, but I got a lot of ATOs. Yes, I ain't get no time out. I got automatic ass whooped. Stop it. But anyway, Divine Feminine is saying, baby girl, didn't I tell you that I had enough? Everybody knows your ass is crazy. You need to seek therapy. Something is wrong with you. This is the seek therapy.
therapy card. You need to have something to write on a piece of paper of your diagnosis and give you some medication. Because, darling dear, you are too focused on me. You are too focused about what I'm doing over my life. And, baby boy, I understand that you are crying over me. You are crying because you made the wrong decision and you picked the wrong female. But, baby boy, baby boy, just face it. You got played when you picked the comic. You were dishonest with me. And now you're in your ego, baby boy, because I don't want you back. Don't you know that I know that you ain't nothing but a ball of drama and confusion, says Divine Feminine? Something is wrong with you, child. You are messed up in the head, cuckoo for Coco Bucks. This next card that comes out is mental health issues, yeah. Why is it that you always talking about me and keep me in your energies? Didn't you tell me when you left, you have options? Go be with your options, Divine Masculine. Only reason why you coming over here, baby boy, is because your credit fucked up. Only reason why you coming over here, baby boy, is because you ain't got no money, honey. Only reason why you want to come over here, because you broken in a bag of glass in the trash. That's why you want to come over here, um, dog. Hmm. But baby, you cannot bring yourself over here. Because remember you talked about my spirituality? Remember you talked about my religion? Remember you made fun of it? You spiritual hater. Do you remember that? Remember when you left out the door, you told me you had many options? Go be with them hoes. You said you said you had hoes in different area codes. Go be with them. Why are you stealing my energy and you not with them hoes? This next call is, I have options, and it's scratched out. You don't have no options because your ass like to start drama. You are a drama starter, masculine. You have female tendencies, too. Sitting over there running your mouth and starting gossip and telling lies about divine feminine, that she was the demise of the relationship. Tell it what it is. Tell it that you are energy vampire and you stay in a third, the third, the 3D energy where you want her back. Tell the truth, divine masculine. Shame the devil, divine masculine. You mad, divine masculine, because you think you got another man. Hmm. That's why you stay up in her energy and you are in an energy vampire. And you lying to yourself because you know you want reconciliation because you see she over there doing good. She doing better than you. She doing better than the female you pick. And that's why you envy divine feminine because she don't want it back. But you keep on. Darling, dear, this is why you received your bad karma, divine masculine, because you had a choice. And you chose the comment. So now you continue to look me up. You ain't going to find that. So we got Divine Masculine looking you up. And we got the comic looking you up. The next card that comes out is looking you up. This will be Divine Masculine looking you up. Dynamic duo is the friends. And the next card that comes out is tag team and hate. So Divine Masculine, not only is the friends looking you up. But all of them is tag team and hate against you. And I'm going to leave on that note and say, that's why Divine Feminine say real women hustle hard to get theirs. They hustle hard to get theirs. They ain't doing no spells, trying to do no magic on nobody, trying to get ahead. I'm going to hustle hard. I'm going to get mine and I'm going to save up and I'm going to be there. I'm not trying to open up no forces and be with no spiritual entities and opening up demons trying to get ahead taking away my spiritual life this common here don't know anything about eternal life that magic ain't gonna get you eternal life darling hating on another and trying to put another down ain't gonna get you eternal life darling and you know better because my ancestors already gave it to you one time before and forgave you and now you back at the magic again okay keep on playing with my ancestors but i'm gonna say if you like my vibe like share and subscribe she really don't know the power of the ancestors but let her do what she do